Hi everyone, it is Michelle here with ProdigyHelp.com and I'm with Abraham Raincatcher who's my first grade avatar and this series is the race series. So I'm not really taking the time to explain how to do the questions. I'm just kind of putting the answers in. Right now when we enter in, I'll be at a level eight and we're gonna play level eight to level 10 with Abraham Raincatcher doing first grade questions. Now feel free to subscribe to my um, channel if you want to keep seeing video updates as I evolve the avatars and I've decided with my first grade challenge I am gonna stay in Firefly Forest so you'll be able to see um, how you can evolve now it looks like we're gonna be attacked by Scaly here it comes here's Scaly so remember we're leveling up from 8 to 10 doing first grade questions and I'm not gonna do this is the race so um, I'm not going to take the time to explain in detail how to solve each of the questions, but I'm going to do better up. Write this number in um, right, this number digit, in form. digit form. Don't forget, 10. you can always hear the speaker. It tells you 10 is 1, 0. Again, first grade questions. We're just trying to get our quest done, and we're at level 8. Let's see how well that did with Scaly. Ooh, it took a lot off Scaly. It took off 72. Missed on us. Let's attack Scaly again. Um, if you've watched my other videos, you'll learn that I don't typically um, evolve my avatars. I'm sorry, I don't typically capture um, other monsters until I'm at least at 15 and playing monsters that are level 10 or higher. The reason is any monster that you catch at a low level, you have to end up evolving and it just takes time. So for me, I prefer to typically evolve my avatar and then um, I'll do the monsters. Don't worry about the member stars and the member we count one, two, three, and we can hit next. Um, these race avatars, I'm not putting a membership on. So don't feel like you have to use a membership. Like kids tend to do better and play more when they have a membership, but you don't have to have one. So if your family doesn't get you one, it's no big deal. All right, let's look at this next question. Remember, I'm trying to level up to level 10, and this is my first grade race. So all the questions deal with first grade. Write this number in digit form three. Cast spell, let's see what happens. Who got us, Pumprickle? Tom Prickle got us. 68. Nice. Okay. We got extra stars. Ooh, we might hit level 9 in this. We're shooting to hit level 10, but we might get level 9 right now. Um, write this number in digit form. 8. Remember, you can always hit the speaker and you can always hit the light bulb to get extra help if you need it when you're playing by yourself. Yes, we got Tom Prickle. Five. And... We just leveled up. Remember, every time that you level up in Prodigy, your hearts get renewed to full strength. So because we jumped from eight to nine, our hearts went up. We won, yes. Let's open a chest. I'm not a member, so I get the wooden chest, which is totally fine. I don't care about it. Um, we did get relic coins. Relic coins, remember, are good if you're going to buy outfits to increase the hearts that you have. I'm not gonna do outfits yet. Um, but that's what those coins are for. Continue following the hand. And remember the little trick, if you haven't seen my other videos, is once you complete one of Flora's quests, instead of having to walk all the way backwards, just hit the map and go right back to the central clearing, and then you can get your next um, challenge. Instead of going all the way up, all the way back, all the way up, all the way back. Much easier to just do the jump. Um, ooh, Trip Trap got us. How would you write this number in its word form? So this is the number four. So I'm gonna hit four. Almost taught you there that four begins with the letter F, but I held myself back and didn't tell you that. Critical hit with 90. That's awesome. I think we're gonna hit level 10 pretty swiftly. Man, we're really going. How would you write this number in its word form? That's the number three. Also, a little bit down on the questions, just so you have some extra time to look. We already got Trip Trap. We might not hit level 10 now, but I bet our next at least one, maybe two battles will end up leveling up to level 10. And actually, you know what? I probably will play level 10. We'll see. We'll see what happens with our quest. Don't worry about the membership stars. One, two, three. Hit next. Here we go. We're just walking. You know what, let's battle this Trip Trap, see if we can get leveled up by play of battling him. Who knows what we're gonna get from him. Might be getting an apple. Apples are good, because if you can't find a healing stone, you can use the apples to heal yourself before your next battle. So all different things. How would you write this number in its word form? That's the number seven. Seven begins with the letter S. Got you, little teaching. I'm a teacher, what can I tell you? Well, used to be teaching. Now I just help kids on the computer do awesome stuff. What? 
Okay, so I guess it's still teaching. Let's attack again. I think we are gonna level up to level 10 with this trip drop. How do you write this number in word form? That's the number eight. Correct, yay! Trip traps, goodbye trip trap. Sorry, see you later. Level 10, this was great. We leveled up to level 10 and we hit our 20 hearts. Now we have 260 hearts and all we're wearing is our training cap. We're not, we don't even have any other armor on. I'm pretty darn proud of Abraham Raincutcher. All right, looking good. Goodbye member stars, we don't need them. We're doing the race, we don't care about the stars. One, two, three, there's our next button. How would we rate it? Prodigy rocks, five stars. Um, looks like we're gonna hit by Palm Prickle. And I don't have to really worry about going to the Healing Stone because I just leveled up and whenever you level up, you get extra hearts. So after Palm Prickle, I'll probably start a new video and maybe do like 10 to 12. We're gonna attack with Batter Up. I just keep using Batter Up. How many smiley faces are there? There are three smiley faces. You do that though, right? <sighs> Looks good. You know, we got so much. We got 69 Palm Prickle. I wonder if we can defeat him in the next time with just one hit. And do you see how that Palm Prickle was a level three? That's why I don't buy avatars, because the higher we get, the higher they are. How many ducks are there? I'm going to use my pen tool. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven ducks. I use the pen tool sometimes because it's just easier for me to keep track of my numbers. I know it can kind of be tedious, but yeah. All right, there we go. I think that we might just go to the next screen and then I'm gonna end our video, 100 coins. Goodbye, member stars. We don't need them. One, two, three, here's our next button. There we go. Okay, well, this is Michelle with ProdigyHelp.com. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you want extra help. I'm going to continue the race with another video. We're going to hit how to get from 10 to 12 and Firefly Forest using first grade questions. All right, catch you guys later. Bye-bye.